How's it going guys? My name is TGP and welcome back to another NBA 2K22 My NBA Rebuilding video. So we have an interesting idea here that I came up with. So I'm going to give myself two seasons to do this. We're going to pick a random team and every time I lose a game with that team, I must trade my best player. So for example, if I had the 76ers, my best player is Joel Embiid. If I don't, if I don't lose, if I go 82 and 0, I keep my team, right? Um, obviously, if I lose, though, I have to then trade my player. Uh, so what I'm going to do is there's a few things I'm turning off. Pretty much everything's off. Injuries are off, all that. Uh, I also turned off fatigue, which I usually don't do. And I have to turn off the I have to turn off the trade deadline because if we lose after March, then we can't trade my player, right? So we're going to do that as well. So two seasons of this. So yeah, if you guys are enjoying the content, leave a like and subscribe. We're on the road to 1K, so please subscribe. And uh, let me down in the comments below this video. Yeah, let's check out my socials. Got those down below in the description. Got a playlist down below containing other NBA 2K22 content. With that being said, let's get on to the gameplay. Oh, yeah, and I do want to add that when I do the trade finder, ooh, I can't just pick what player I want. <laughs> it's got to be a random trade to make it harder. We got two seasons. So I'm free, like, off season, I can do whatever I want. I can, like, make trades, sign people, and all of that. I can do anything. Free agent, like, off season, I'm um, free limits. Uh, but during the season, not so much. So, uh, yeah, here we go. Three, two, one. Let's stop. It's going to be the Brooklyn Nets. Oh, my gosh. Stop it. Stop it. Okay. I mean, hey, it stopped on the Nets. So, we're going to pick the Nets. So, we'll pick them. Advance. Um, and there you go. So, we're going to have the Brooklyn Nets on the t uh, using them. So, every time I lose a game, I must make a trade. So, this could be pretty difficult also they don't have cap space so again we're only doing two seasons of this so um you know in the in, in the in the off season we got plenty of time so uh yeah, let's take a look at the the rotation so the starting five is going to be uh james Harden, kyrie Irving, joe harris kevin durant marcus aldridge patty mills deandre uh, Bembry, nicholas claxton blake griffin uh getting minutes off of the bench and then the rest of the team is there too so not too bad but um yeah, we got to not lose. That's the thing, but it might be tough. I wish I had the Pelicans because I feel like they win a lot of games. But then again, if I lost the game, I'd have to trade Zion. So do I really want the Pelicans? Not really. So, <laughs> oh, goodness. Yeah, that's, uh, that's something I have to consider. So, all right, well, let's just start simulating. We're just going to simulate uh, to the end of the year. I don't even think I'm going to stop and show you guys uh, stats. So once we lose, so we just lost to the Sixers. Right? So now we have to literally make a trade. Well, the problem with Kevin Durant is I don't know if we'll get... Oh, we do get offers. Okay, so there's two offers. So... Okay. We're just going to random it. Here we go. Three, two, one. And we're trading Kevin Durant and Paul Mills after the Jazz for Rudy Gobert and Bog Boham Bogdanovich. So we have to do that since we lost the game. So that's annoying. Uh, <laughs> and we'll just always have the CPU just a rotation. So now we lost to the Heat. So basically, it's just going to be that. We just have to, every time we lose a game, we trade our best player. So now we have to trade Kyrie Irving. Got 15 offers for him in the trade finder. So we're going to stop on the, this, this next offer. 3, 2, 1. And we're trading him to the Pacers. For DeMontis, Simonis, and Miles Turner, we also traded by James Johnson. That's actually not the end. It's not the end-all, be-all, I guess. But uh, yeah, you guys can see that this challenge can get pretty crazy. So... Uh, all right, let's just uh, keep simulating, and every time I lose, I will uh, show you, pop up a trade. All right, loss to the Pistons, 3-2-1. So we got to trade James Harden and Joe Harris to the Warriors for Klay Thompson and Draymond Green. Okay. All right, we got another loss, 3-2-1. And we are going to be trading Rudy Gobert and Javon Carter to the Pistons for Sadiq Bey and Jeremy Grant. Okay. All right, we had another loss, so here we go. Next trade, Sabonis. Uh, is going to the Lakers. So we have to trade Sabonis and Bogdanovich. So even though I didn't select Bogdanovich in the trade finder, it's only the best player. Uh, so yeah, we have to get Westbrook and Monk. Ugh, that's not very good. All right, another loss. Again, we're going to be sitting here for a very long time. Clay Thompson and DeAndre Bembry to the Raptors for Pascal Siakam and Garrett Trent Jr. Okay. I got to trade Pascal Siakam since we just lost. So here we go. Trade finder, 3-2-1 stop. It's going to be Tobias Harris and a second-round pick. So Pascal's going to the Sixers. 
All right, we just we just got friggin' Tobias Harris. Now we have to trade him, and it's gonna be to the Grizzlies. Wake up, friends, including as well. We get Stephen Adams and Kyle Anderson. All right, another trade. I gotta trade Draymond Green since we lost to the Knicks, and it's gonna be to the Lakers. We also get uh, uh we have to trade Aldridge as well. We do get some bonus back, which is pretty solid, but we're probably gonna have to flip him at some point. And then Wayne Ellington. We just got some bonus back, and now we gotta trade him again. Unbelievable. Oh goodness. All right. Here we go. Random. 3, 2, 1. Stop. It's going to be for DeJounte Murray. We also have to give up a second round pick. All right. We lost to the Pistons. Now I got to trade DeJounte Murray. Oh, God. All right. Here we go. We're going to stop in 3, 2, 1. I wasn't looking. And oh, goodness. To the Warriors. And Dayron Sharp as well. We have to get back Jonathan Kuminga and Joe Harris. That's. That's kind of annoying. We also give him a trade exception. Oh, goodness. All right, got to trade Miles Turner. So here we go. Three, two, one, stop. It's going to be for Tyus Jones and Jared Culver. We're also throwing in Wayne Ellington. We're still in December. <laughs> so now Jeremy Grant throwing him in the block. Here we go. Uh, we're going to stop simulating in three, two, one. Al Horford and Enos Freedom for Jeremy Grant and Patty Mills. Great. I'm the flip Westbrook. So we're going to stop the trade finder in two, one now. There we go. Tobias Harris and John Conchar for Russell Westbrook and Cam Thomas. All right, Toby's getting traded once again. Three, two, one, stop. Markel Fultz, Jonathan Isaac, and we also have to give up Bruce Brown. I didn't know Steven Adams was an 82 overall, but okay. So we're just going to throw him in the trade finder. And here we go. Three, two, one, stop. Vucevic and Derek Jones Jr. We also have to give Kyle Anderson that Steven Adams trade. Got Vucevic, and now we're flipping him. So here we go. Who are we flipping him for? It's going to be for Russell Westbrook and Xavier Tillman. We also have to give up Markel Fultz. All right, we lost another game, so now Westbrook is back on the block. So we're going to stop the trade finder in three, two, one. Stop. And it's going to be for Julius Randle and Evan Fournier. And we also have Nicholas Claxton. All right, 2K simulation's really bugging out. I got another loss, so now i got to flip Julius Randle. So we're just going to start the trade finder. So here we go. Three, two, one. Stop. Eric Bledsoe and Keon Johnson. And I have to give it a Okay, that's a bad trade. We lost to the Pelicans, so now we got to trade away Al Horford. We're going to stop in 2-1. Boom. Hamidou Diallo, Kelly Olenek, and I give up Al Horford and Xavier Tillman. We've lost two straight games, so now I have to trade Jonathan Isaac and Sadiq Bey. So we'll trade Jonathan Isaac first. So unless there's a trade for him and Sadiq Bey, we're just going to stop in 3-2-1. Okay, so Tim Hardaway, Dwight Powell, Jonathan Isaac, Joe Harris. And then because I lost another game, I tried to stop simulating, but it didn't work. We're going to have to flip away Sadiq Bay. So here we go. We're just going to simulate, uh, just do the trade deadline or trade thing. Three, two, one, stop. It's going to be for Patrick Williams, Tony Bradley. We've got to give it to Dwight Powell, who we just got. And Sadiq Bay definitely lost that trade. Here we go. Three, two, one, stop. Terrence Ross and a second round pick for Gary Trent Jr. Uh, we are on a massive losing streak right now. We're probably going to lose this next game. Yep, so we got to do another trade. Incredible. Oh, goodness. Tyus Jones now. It just It's just never ending. That's why I'm only doing two seasons. I feel like two seasons is too much of this. I should just do one, but I'm putting myself through the pain and agony for you guys. So here we go. Three, two, one, stop. It's going to be for Larry Nance. We also have a trade exception that they're giving them. So there you go. Uh, wait, we're going to lose this game. No, we didn't lose. I thought we would lose. We're going to lose this one though, right? No. Okay. Uh, we lost that one. All right, let's make another trade. Okay, I stopped simulating, or stopped uh, the trade finder. I was sneezing. I cut that part out, though, of me sneezing. But we landed on Calvin Johnson and Lonnie Walker. I'm going to trade away Hamidou Diallo and Malik Monk. Johnson was here for one game, and now he's gone. So where is he going to go now? Well, let's see. Here we go. Close our eyes. Three, two, one. And we're going to stop. And it's going to be Hamidou Diallo and Jack Jakob Pertl. All right, man. So we're, he's going back to the Spurs. <laughs> Pretty funny. All right, we're going to stop simulating in three, or trade deadline in three, two, one. Larry Nance, okay. All right, you know what I'm going to do? To speed up this video and just speeding up my my, my, my sanity, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to enable the trade deadline again. And I'll tell you why. The reason is, number one, I, I don't want to sit through another friggin' 50 minutes of this crap. So we're going to turn that back on. But also, I think it makes it interesting because then we have our team, and then it's like, okay, these are the people we have, these are the people we could trade, and then we could sign a bunch of people in the offseason. That way we're not just constantly, like, making trades. 
So I'm going to do that instead. I'm going to actually change the sliders back. So that way we can we can turn on... Can we turn on the trade deadline? I don't know if I can. If I can't, then then I then I screwed up, screwed myself over here. And I'm just going to have to sit through this. But I really don't want to have to. Um, if I can avoid having to. So we'll turn that on. I don't remember where that would be. Okay, see, like, it's like every time, because we're, we're going to constantly lose. So it's like, okay, we just lost two straight, because I tried to stop simulating, it didn't work. Okay, so, all right, we got to make two trades. I'm going to do law number one. Just see what we get for him. All right, we're just we're just gonna stop in three, two, one. It's gonna be Jalen Johnson, Dawn Wright. We got to trade away Larry Nance as well, and add an exception or add an exception. There we go. And then we will now trade away Enos Freedom. And here we go. We're gonna do uh, stop in three, two, one. Santi Aldama, a first round pick. Great. All right. So yeah, we'll, 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 we'll just do it to the trade deadline. I think that just makes more sense because, quite frankly, uh, where is the trade deadline? I don't know where it is. All right, Tim Hardaway Jr., 3-2-1, stop. For Josh Richardson, Marcus Smart, we all got to give up Tony Bradley. All right, Evan Fournier, we're going to stop right here. It's going to be for Tim Hardaway Jr. and a second round pick. Okay, I don't think it, I don't think it takes into effect until next season, so... I guess just this rest of the season, we're just going to do random trades like this every time we lose. So, oh boy. All right, Yaka Pirtle, who are we trading you for? Mason Plumlee, and we have to give him a second round pick. That's an L trade. Who's it going to be? Let's see. Here we go. We're going to stop it in three, two, one. And it's going to be for Joe Harris and a second round pick. So we get Joe Harris back. All right, we're going to stop simulating in three, two, one. Robert Covington and a second round pick. Fantastic. All right, so here we go. What's it going to be? 3 2 1 stop. Tim Hardaway for Josh Richardson. We've got to give him a second round pick. Great. The one that we just got. And we get a trade exception. Yeah, now I have to trade away Josh Richardson because we just lost. And who's it going to be for? Will Barton. Will Barton's got to go. See, that's why I want to. Now I want to turn the trade deadline because I, I just. I, now we're just losing every single game. Uh, Will Barton, Sandy Aldama for Alec Burks and Taj Gibson. All right. That's actually not the worst trade in the world. And speaking of the Knicks, we're taking them on, and look at that. We lose to them. And who do I have to trade? The guy we just traded for, Alec Burks. So what are we going to trade him for? Let's find out. Here we go. In three, two, one, we're going to stop, and it's going to be for uh, Darius Arch and Cameron Payne. We also got to throw in Mason Plumlee. All right, tried to stop the simulation. Couldn't stop it fast enough, so now we're going to trade away Derek Jones. Three, two, one, stop. It's going to be for Tim Hardaway Jr., Justice Winslow. We also get uh, Taj Gibson in the deal as well so we're gonna make that trade and a trade exception and i gotta make another trade i technically lost i guess tim hardaway is my best player so we gotta flip tim hardaway now so who are we gonna flip him for three two one it's gonna be for marcus morris luke canard also trade away campaign all right who's it gonna be we're gonna stop on larry nance lou williams we're gonna trade away morris and winslow all right larry nance in the trade finder we're gonna stop right here let's see who's it gonna be d'anthony melton we gotta trade away a first round pick as well that's annoying well, we actually got a win, and then we lost, so now we got to trade away to Anthony Melton. We got we won one game, and then we lost the next one. Oh boy, yeah, trade deadline at the end at the end of the second season, and we'll just rock with whatever team we have. I think that just makes the most sense. Uh, so we're gonna go with Anthony Melton, Eric Bledsoe to the Pistons, Al Horford, Trey Lyles. All right, here we go. We're gonna stop at three, two, one. All right, Karis Lewis, T.J. McConnell for Al Horford, Kendrick Williams. That's actually not too bad. I'll take that from the Pacers. We lost the next game we literally played, and now we have to trade away Karis Avert, Robert Covington to the Magic for Tobias Harris and each one more. Tobias isn't bad, but like we're gonna lose our next game because it's against the Bucks. So now I gotta trade Tobias Harris. This is just painful. This is literally painful. All right, who we traded him for? John Wall, straight up. All right, cool. And the thing is too is like the random aspect of it makes it even more annoying. Now we have to get back Al over to Jeremy Lamb. Keon Johnson, John Wall to the Pacers, and we're probably going to trade Al Horford right here. Yes, we get to trade him again. So where is he going to end up now? Let's find out. Here we go. We're just going to randomize. 3, 2, 1, and we are going to stop right here. Evan Fournier, Grant Williams. We get. We also throw in Etuan Moore 
and a trade exception as well. All right, this is the last trade of the first season. Uh, yeah, I, yeah, we need a trade deadline. Like, <laughs> for the second season, just to see what team we end up with and if we can actually make the playoffs. So, first round pick in Dario Saric and a second round pick in Jason Tate. Um, you know, we're going to lose this game. So, well, maybe we won't. But if we do, yeah, we lost. But we're not making a trade. Now we're just going to make a bunch of trades to make this team good for the for for the season but the problem is do we even want good players i don't even know what we should go after here because every time we lose we have to trade our best player it's like the, it, there's really nothing you can do oh my gosh okay <sighs> all right well, we were terrible. Um, it's not worth showing you guys stats It's in this video because we just traded so many guys. So we ended up with a horrible record. That's all that you really need to know. We were 31 and 51. I'm actually surprised that we were that. Like, you'd think we would be a lot worse, but really not too bad. Let's make our predictions now. Who's going to win the finals? The Pelicans. That is my prediction. And what do you know? Wow. The Pelicans win the finals in the most... It, it's like... It's like... I, I... This is why, man. Okay. I just... It, it, you just know... Every time you see that, you know, like, okay, they're gonna win. They almost didn't. They almost lost, but then they swept the Bulls. Okay. Uh, I guess Hall of Fame inductees. I forgot to uh, auto that. It doesn't really matter. We don't have our pick. To add insult to injury, don't have our pick. And the Rockets have two top three picks. I really needed two I really need two top picks. Because at the very least, if we get like young guys and, and when we lose, we could still get some valuable like pieces for them. So now we're going to the NBA draft, but here's the thing. We had a bunch of guys on my team. Quite frankly, I don't want any of them. So we're just gonna make a bunch of trades here now. These trades I'm allowed to like pick whichever one I want because it's the off season. So TJ McConnell, Joe Harrison, a second round pick to the Pistons for Xavier Tillman and Isaiah Livers. All right. You know what? I'll do this trade with Charlotte. Evan Fournier, Luke Kennard for Gordon Hayward. I'm fine with that. All right. We're going to do this deal with the Spurs. Isaiah Livers, Jalen Johnson, and a, and a pick swap. Keldon Johnson, Derek White. So pretty solid. I don't know how much cap space we have now, uh, but we got... We have some decent players here. I mean, of course, Gordon Hayward. If I did, like, a package here, can I get, like, some really good players? And Paul George. <clears throat> Nothing great. Okay, I, I think we'll just keep that the way it is. Maybe we can sign a guy or two in free agency. Although, again, it's not going to matter. Because the minute we lose, we have to trade them. That's the thing. It's like... What are you supposed to do? So I don't have any picks. Or if I do, they're not good. So, whatever just happened, happened. I guess I took off rookie signing. Um, not that it really matters, because we only have one more season. Lonnie Walker, Edwards, David Duke Jr. And we'll offer them all qualifiers, I guess. And in terms of money, uh, we do have a little bit of cash here to potentially spend. So, I mean, I could try to get, like, a good player. We could try to get, like, a, a Zachariah Levine, but I think he's going to go back. We could get a, a Bradacious Beal. Uh, no, we actually can't. Well, yeah, no, he's not going to come here. Eh. Bobby Portis is actually pretty solid. Jalen Brunson could be decent. Like a decent player. Help me get some wins, 17 million. We can get like a decent shooting guard that's not like too expensive. Like a, like a, uh, I was going to say like a Patrick Beverly, but eh. I guess Lonnie Walker can kind of fill in that, fill in those shoes there. Jeremy Lamb. Uh, we'll go Caleb Martin, actually. I feel like he'd be a bit better. So we'll go Caleb Martin. So we can get Jalen Brunson, Caleb Martin. I guess that's okay. And we want to announce the rights on DeLon Wright and uh, Lonnie Walker. Okay. Jeremy Lamb announced the rights on. And then a bunch of trade exception stuff, which we don't really need. And then I guess we'll just announce the rights on them. So we'll have 25 million now. 
Uh, is that how much I'll actually be able to have? We have a lot of power forwards. So we have 2.73 million. And we have how many power forwards? Six? Six power forwards? Uh, yeah, we have six power forwards. So let's see if we can make a couple trades here to get maybe like um, a better, like another point guard and stuff. So let's see if we can make a couple trades here. All right, I'm going to just deal with the Nuggets. So we're going to get Jamal Murray, Georges Niang. We're going to have to give Patrick Williams, Grant Williams, and Derek Wright. Probably could bite bite me in the ass, especially once we lose, because we have to trade Jamal Murray anyway. But, um, you know, we're going for it. I'm going to trade away Jarrett Culver, Georges Niang, and a second-round pick to the Pelicans. Getting back Devontae Graham and Willie Hernan Gomez. The team that we're going to have here is Jamal Murray, Gordon Hayward, Keldon Johnson, Jay Sean Tate, Jalen Brunson, Caleb Martin, Jonathan Kuminga, Xavier Tillman, Devontae Graham, Trey Lyles, Willie Hernan Gomez, Jeremy Lamb, Bryn Forbes, Damian Lee, Lou Williams, and once we lose our first game of the season, we will no longer have Jamal Murray, but it's all good, so, um, I mean, we got one more season. The good thing is I have a tr the trade deadline on here. That way, if we're somewhat decent and we could potentially make the playoffs, uh, then there is something to behold there, I, I believe. I, I mean, I thought I had turned it on, but if I didn't, then... Well, then I screwed myself over, but uh, it is what it is. I mean, if you guys are enjoying the video, that's all that really matters to me. So let's take a look at the starting five. So it's going to be Jamal Murray, Jalen Brunson, Gordon Hayward, Kelvin Johnson, Willie Hernan Gomez. Then we got Jay Sean Tate, Caleb Martin, Xavier Tillman, Devontae Graham, Jonathan Kaminga is not getting any minutes. Those guys aren't getting any minutes. Okay. It's, it's not an awful team, but it ain't good. Uh, it's just a proficiency. Three and a half perimeter centric. I guess we'll rock with that. Yeah, we'll rock with perimeter centric. All right, so first game of the season against the Knicks. Are we going to win? Nope. We got to make a trade already. Love this. I absolutely love this video so much because now Jamal Murray is going to be traded. And let's see for what. Probably a bag of cookies. Maybe not. Maybe we'll get like a decent trade in the trade finder. Three, two, one. Kyle Lowry, Max Schroes. We got to give up Lou Williams. Actually, it, it could be a lot worse, but yeah. It's not the greatest trade either. Well, we got to say goodbye to Gordon Hayward for, let's stop, D'Angelo Russell. All right, Keldon Johnson in the trade finder for Zaire Williams in a first round pick that I don't give a shit about. Why did I think that this would be a good video idea? Why Why did I think, why did I think that this would be a good video idea? Zeke Naji in a second round. Ugh, what are these trades? I trade Jalen Brunson for Markel Fultz. All right, D'Angelo Russell, who am I trading you for? Malik Beasley and Eric Gordon. And I'm also giving up Damian Lee. Love it. All right. Kyle Lowry for Draymond Green. And I also give him a first-round pick. We actually had a win. We got a win, finally. I lost two games in a row, and I forgot to stop simulating, or I didn't do it fast enough. So now we got to trade away Markel Fultz, Caleb Martin for Kevin Love, J.D. McDaniels. And, I mean, when I had my team, I still had Draymond Green, my second-best player, but we'll just trade away Kevin Love. I'll be fair, since he's my best player now. So Kevin Love doesn't even get to play a game with us, and we're trading to the Houston Rockets for Tobias Harris and first-round pick. Well, so long, Tobias Harris for and Zeke Naji for Julius Randle, who's on the Clippers, and Tim Hardaway Jr. I don't know who the Clippers traded to the Knicks to get Julius Randle, but uh, guess who's not staying on my team for that long? Julius Randle, because I just lost to the Clipper. Uh, who did I lose? I don't know who I lost to. I lost to somebody. Uh, well, who is he going to be for? Mikael Bridges, Cam Johnson, who else got to trade with Max Drews? I think this video is going to be a pain in the ass because I, I'm going to have to make so many cuts. <sighs> it's just going to be so annoying. Mikael Bridges, Brent Forms for Markel Fultz and Caleb Martin. All right, here we go. Draymond Green, Jeremy Lamb for DeAnthony Melton and Joe Harris. I'm literally losing every single game. <laughs> I, I can't even get like a two-game win streak. I just keep losing. It's it's just it's just so annoying. We're going to lose this game, right? Yep. You can't make this up. I just got Spencer Dinwiddie, and now I have to literally trade him. And who it's going to be for, we're going to stop right here. For Bogdanovich and a second-round pick that I don't care about. All right, I stopped the simulation one game too late, so now i got to trade away Bogdanovich, Kernan Gomez for Olenek and Zach Collins, and then, because I lost another game, and I tried to stop the simulation, and it didn't let me stop, Malik Beasley now has to be traded, and it's going to be for Jordan Clarkson and a second-round pick. DeAnthony Melton is going to the Clippers, and also a second-round pick. Just trading away seconds. Yaka Perta, welcome to the team for maybe a game, and then you're probably going to get traded, right? Oh, not yet. 
but you eventually will. I guess it's Xavier Tillman's turn. And who's it going to be for? We're going to stop in 3, 2, 1. It's going to be for a first-round pick that I don't care about and Denzel Valentine. Jaden McDaniels. Who are we trading you to? The Mavericks for Moses Brown in a first-round pick. And we got to get a second-round pick in return. Johnson is going to the Bucks for Royce O'Neal in a second-round pick. And a trade exception is going to them, too. All right, Rui Hachimura is going to the Raptors for Ken Birch and a first round pick that I don't care about. Leo Linick going to the Wizards and a second round pick for Caleb Martin. Jackson to the Pelicans, as well as Trey Lauffer and Keel Alexander Walker and Jared Culver. Jakob Pertl is going to be going to the Suns for Alec Burks. And there goes Caleb Martin, and he's going to the Raptors for Grayson Allen. All right, I gotta trade away Kuminga. This could be a decent trade, though, if I can get, like, a good package here. And it's for Patrick Baldwin Jr. and Terrence Davis. And I gotta trade with Garrison Allen. That's not the trade I wanted to do or wanted it to land on. I really hate this video. Devontae Graham, Denzel Valentine for Romeo Langford and Patrick, a.k.a. Patty Mills. I finally had gotten a win. I was like, oh, we finally got a win. And then we lost right away. So now we got to trade away Hardaway and Langford for Kelly Olenek and Reggie Bullock. Guys, we actually went on a two-game win streak. And now I have to trade away Kelly Olenek. Oh, Lord have mercy on my soul. Uh, but we're trading him for and a second-round pick for Taylor Horton-Tucker. Okay. All right. Taylor Horton-Tucker going to the Portland Trailblazers with a first-round pick for Norman Powell. And, uh, Norman Powell, thanks for playing your one game with us because we're going to lose to the Pistons, which means now we have to trade you. And we're going to be trading him to the Spurs, and we get a first-round pick I don't care about, which actually is ours. Oh, it's a swap worse. Dark McDermott, and we have to trade away a lotto pick. All right, this is what we stopped on. Dallas, Gary Clark, and first-round pick for Ken Birch. Cool. It's what happens we have nothing better to do with your life. Nikhil Alexander Ward, Gilly Clark for Caleb Houston and Michael Carter Williams. Man, this team is just terrible. Absolutely terrible. Um, I don't know what to say. Alec Burks now is in the trade finder. And it's going to be for Daniil Gallinari. And we also trade away Doug McDermott. We get a first round pick that I don't care about. All right, three, two, one. Terrence Davis for Fancondo, Fancudo, Campazzo, and a second round pick. All right, who's it going to be? Daniel Gallinari in your first round pick to the Pistons for Draymond Green in a second. Draymond Green is going to the Trailblazers with a first round pick for Terrence Ross and Derek Favors. Royce O'Neal, Michael Carter Williams to the Jazz for Reggie Jackson and Yudoka Azubuki. If these trades like weren't random, I might have a little bit more success. Terrence Ross in a second round pick for Ken Birch. Ken Birch is going. To the Trailblazers, <laughs> Joe Harris and Draymond Green's coming back again for like the millionth time, as well as uh, I think that was Damian Lee. Although Draymond Green is getting traded right here, yeah. All right, Draymond Green, Fancondo, Facundo, Campazzo for D'Angelo Russell and R.J. Nembhard. D'Angelo Russell is going to the Wizards with Nembhard for Montrezl Harrell and Tim Hardaway Jr. All right, Harrell and Bullock to the Pacers for Malcolm Brogdon and Terry Taylor. All right. All right, stop it in 3, 2, 1. Malcolm Brogdon and a first-round pick to the Wizards for D'Angelo Russell in a second-round pick. I really hope that there's a trade deadline in this season because if there's not, I'm going to be really pissed. Okay, Russell's going to the Trailblazers for second-round pick for C.J. McCollum. All right, C.J. McCollum to the Lakers for Kyle Lowry in a second-round pick. All right, Kyle Lowry in a second-round pick to the Pistons for Danilo Gallinari. That is something. All right. So, let me just show you guys this, the final, this is the final team that we ended up with. So, I could keep, I could turn off trade deadline and keep going, but quite frankly, we're losing every single game and I'm having to stop every single time. I'm getting sick and tired of it. So, we're just going to see how bad this team ends up doing. So yeah, Hardaway Jr., Danilo Gallinari, Zach Collins, I didn't even know he was on my team, uh, Moses Brown, Derek Favors, Eric Gordon. Patrick Baldwin Jr., Zaire Williams, Jarrett Culver, Patty Mills, Caleb Houston, Reggie Jackson, Yudoka Azbugi, Damian Jones, Terry Taylor. That's the final result of this atrocity of a team.
and of a challenge. I am never doing this again. Um, maybe, I don't know if you guys want to see this again. Uh, we'll just see how bad we end up doing. So I'll see you guys. Oh, wow, look at that. We got to win. Uh, I'll see you guys once it's done simulating. All right, so we ended up obviously with the worst record. I mean, not a surprise. So the, I completely failed the challenge. I thought, oh, maybe we can, you know, it would make some interesting trades. I mean, the random element was cool, but yeah, we were awful. 12 and 70 awful. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I mean, if we want to do a video and I don't override the save, let me know down in the comments below if we should rebuild this team and see if we can win a championship with this team as is and uh, kind of go from there if you guys want to see me try to do that. Uh, but just let me know down in the comments below if you want me to see me, want to see me try to do that. Uh, if in case I forget, you know. In case I forget and you never see, you never see me make a video like this again or if no one's like let me know in the comments that they want to see me do this, then, you know, that I'm probably just going to end up overriding it. And I get to see this again. Uh, like it, it, It's actually kind of funny. You know what we should do? I have a good video idea. I'm going to do the following video idea. And it might take me forever. But I, I, I really think we should do this. And I'm sure someone's done it. Let's simulate the first season of NBA 2K20. Just like the 2021-22 season from the beginning. All right? with the same settings and see how many times certain people win awards and just like see what the the probability is for people because i feel like every time like i turn off injuries they always win i i it just it's just a matter of fact i don't know what it is i don't know why 2k just loves them so much but I digress. Um, either way, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let's just uh, close it out. As well, I'm going to have fun editing this with all these cuts that I have to make. So please leave a like and subscribe if, you're, if you enjoyed the content. And uh, we're on the road to 1K. So yeah, uh, please comment down below this video is. Got my socials down in the description. Got a playlist down below for 2K22. Check out my channel if you like content from me. And yeah, with that being said, guys, take care. Have a great night. See you soon. And peace.